thank you guys. Thank you guys very, very much for like watching my videos. I, I gotta, I just gotta say this again, cause my last video did really well. A lot of people watched it, commented. It, it just feels nice that people are watching my videos. And yeah, this video is gonna start off like pretty much right where the last one left off, cause I recorded way too much. And yeah, I had to um. I had to cut the last video there because I didn't want the video to be way too long. Also, I wanted to mention right here that my friend Bong Bong Roblox also just put out um, an ASTD video. So if you're interested, go give it a watch. I thought it was pretty funny and pretty good video. So if you're interested, give him a watch. But yeah, that's enough for the intro. Uh, let's get into the video now. Bye. New raid added in World 2 that drops Sniper token. Chance to also drop uh, Sinon, I guess. Let me see that raid. Snipe raid, huh? Might as well go check that out then. Yeah, let's see the snipe raid and what it's about. Hopefully it's not too difficult. Doesn't look like it will be too difficult, but I could be wrong. Oh yeah, I still have animations on. Uh oh. Oh, max units reached. Okay, the boss has 10 billion health. Dang. And with the nerfed Ombra, she won't be doing nearly as much damage now but I should still be able to take this boss down it's the it's like it's the really bad Kirito model oh yeah there's multiple oh no nah. oh no nah. I forgot about that and since there's two paths there's gonna be two bosses And I already forgot what enchantment the enemies were. Was it fire? I think it was fire. I wonder why exactly is Ombra attacking this one instead of the one that's in first. When she is set to attack, well, first. I don't know. All I know is that I am definitely going to lose this. Yeah. I'm gonna I'm replay it just to see uh, what enchantment the enemies were. So yeah, they really nerfed Ombra, huh? That's sad. But I guess she was just really good. She does still do decent damage though, but... Dang. So yeah, the DOT nerf is... Single place DOT units now deal 25% of their damage when applying status effects. So she's only dealing... 25% of that 14.1 mil, five times. Okay, so her bleed is technically dealing, what? Uh, divide that by, divide her damage by four and times it by five. And that's how much she's dealing. Okay. Now let me replay to see the enchantment again, because I forgot. It's fire, right? Yeah, it is. Okay, so it's a water enchant raid, hmm? And what I meant by that is that you want to use water enchant units in there. It is 19 waves as well, so... Aizen's possible. For taking down the bosses. Yeah, okay. Oh yeah, this guy. I wonder if he's any good in, in there. Yeah, so Jack's really good. But you know... Time to keep on going with this a little bit. Just that, just a little bit more. Just a little bit more gambling.
Oh yeah, they buffed Jiren as well. The Jiren 7 star, because now the meditation damage stays forever. So it might actually be good now to use an uh, infinite. Oh wow, another Luffy kid. <laughs> Dang. Oh! Hey! Okay. Thanks, game. Hit you go. Nice. Well, still got a free one, so might as well use that. Now, what am I missing? I'm, I guess, Kizaru. I was gonna call it here. But I'll still try to get Kizaru for a little bit. Oh. Well, I'm full. I'll level up Pain. Not Evolve, uh, Feed. Alright, I think that's enough for now. Okay. Oh, then I'm gonna try to get Kizaru for a bit. I'll go down to like a thousand stardust for now. Don't bait me now. Started with a five. St okay, it's bait. Already got two five stars. Yep. <sighs> oh, well, hey, finishing off strong. Let's go, Joe. But I guess I don't necessarily mind that. Getting him um, evolved to the seven star as a level one is going to be better for uh, better for the gauntlet because he won't be doing that much damage to the units or the enemies. I mean, but yeah, the banner's about to change. Maybe there's going to be something new here. Nope, nothing new. Damn, Daniel. <laughs> Uh, I thought you could only get seen on from um, the raid, but I guess she's on Y banner now, so might as well get her then. We'll go. How many do I need, though? I need three. Okay. I could get her from the raid, but I don't know. I might as well um, be certain and get all of them from this. Just, you know, I might not get any at all from the braid. Who knows? There we go. Nice. Well, I was thinking that, you know, I might as well try to go for that, um, that Kizaru. I don't know what else to use my Stardust on, and I think he's the only one that I don't have. From the banners. Let me just make sure I have them. I don't have Kizaru. I have all of them. I have all of them. There's no like. Okay. I guess it's um. It's time to roll on this then again. Oh, okay. It's a one in three chance. Nah, another Gojo. 
Dang. Well, nothing can be worse than what happened with Broly, so I don't really care if I don't get him. I would like to get him, though, but... Yeah, I'm... I'm emotionally numb after trying to get Broly. Like, the banner's changed. Let me see what's on there after this one. Mm, okay. Okay, nothing new. Well, she's new, but I already got her. I already got her. Okay, could be bait once again. Hopefully not, though. Ah, uh, I think it is. Yep. <sighs> that time I got three five stars as well, but it didn't do the Luffy falling on his face. I guess it really is just random. Well, um... Sage mode Naruto always means that you don't get, like, anything. Oh! Chippy chippy no chapa chapa. Oi oi. Dooby dooby daba daba janega. Okay. There we go, now I have all of them. I have all of the Stardust units. Uh, does Kizaru need, um... Does Kizaru need star fruits that like the fruits from a uh, marine HQ to evolve? I would guess. Oh, three rubber rubber fruits and three of those fruits from uh, marine HQ. Huh. Okay. A oh, good thing I didn't um go to sleep just yet. I was uh, I was gonna go to sleep, but. Uh, Akaza has appeared on the banner, and he apparently has a pretty cool, um, pretty cool blessing. Yeah. There we go. Not too bad. Not too bad. Didn't have to spend that much. Hmm. Okay. It's like the compass thing. Yeah, that's cool. That's a cool blessing. I like that. Well, well, well. We're gonna do some um, mythical freedom with Bong Bong here. I need some. I need some of those fruits. I need some of that stuff. So I wanna. I wanna evolve um, Kizaru, and I do wanna get one of my Luffy's up to the six star version as well. Since he is pretty good. All right, here we go. I'm gonna I'm gonna evolve one of the Luffy's into the six star because I think the six star is actually pretty good. Yeah, and I'm just gonna keep him as it and smacks him out. Nice. So they have Bucky on uh, the C banner, so I'm a, I'm a roll for him since I don't have him. Oh, he's holy as well. Special ability as well. Oh, that's cool. Just don't make me go to pity again. Okay, it, I didn't have to go to pity, that's nice. Well, I just helped um, Bon Bon get all the fruits that he needed from uh, Mythical Freedom. And now... Because I want to evolve Kizaru next. I want to I wanna get these fruits from... Marine HQ, and then I'm gonna go get the Angels. So yeah, Marine A Wait, this isn't Raids. This is Infinite Mode. And of course, once again... I, um... I forgot... That there are elemental enemies. Wait, I went to Infinite again instead of... I'm so stupid. Oh yeah, I noticed something weird. When I go into either, like, World 1 or... Uh, one of the matches, one of the... Raids or any stage... My pose changes. Like, out here, my pose is like this, just chilling like this to the side. And then in the raid, the pose is like pointing 
forward like this for some reason. Uh, I don't really get it, but yeah, that's how it is, I guess. Ugh, I didn't even remember to put that Ultra Magic Orb on anyone. Oh, well, that doesn't really matter, I guess. Let's see, first one. How many fruits? Two, please. One. Oh. Hopefully the next one gives two, so I'm not gonna do this two times. One. One fruit, huh? So Bong Bong wanted to join me in the Marine HQ. Uh, yeah, I'ma let him join me now. So come on in. in. I'm not gonna say what I wanna say now. But just, yeah, come on in. If you know, you know. Of course, the last one, I get two, but I'm still gonna do it more with Bong Bong. Because he still needs some. Alright, this is the last one that we need. Or the last one Bong Bong needs. I already I already got him last time. There we go. Now we just need the angels to evolve Kizaru. Yeah. Okay, Bong Bong's also joining me in getting those angels. So yeah, we will go do that now. Okay, please tell me I have enough angels now. Hopefully. Let's see, angel. I don't think I do. Um, wait, I... Wait, actually... Hmm. Oh, I do. There we go. Uh, Light Marine... Evolve. There we go. Light Marine, serious. Ooh, he has a blessing? Oh, you just get his, like, light sword. I mean, that's okay. I don't mind that. Maybe it would fill with, like, Meliodas. Okay, well, here's two units that I still want to look at here in training. Let's see. Gotta look at Akaza and Six Star Kizaru. Let's see what these guys can do. Oh, yeah, Kizaru is a hill unit, okay. I mean, simple, but pretty cool. That might hurt someone's eyes if you, like, speed up the animation or something. It's gonna... It's gonna be, you know, a little bit... Whoa. That circle is massive. It's the size of his, like, whole AoE, like, his range. So that's almost like a full AoE attack. Wow. Very big circle, huh? And this animation is really cool as well. Nice. Then, Sacred Treasures. That's the last upgrade, huh? Whoa. Yeah, that's gonna... That's gonna hurt someone's eyes, for sure. Yeah, I'm gonna make that darker in editing, because that is bright. And if I make it 3x speed... <laughs> yeah, that's uh, that's pretty crazy. But yeah, it's a pretty cool unit. I like it, I like it. Then let's check out Akaza. It's still on 3x. Oh, his attack doesn't have any sounds. Eh, the animation's alright though. Not bad. Nothing crazy. Pretty decently sized circle on placement though, not a lot of damage though, but he is level 1. Oh, he's hybrid. Wait, when did he get hybrid? Oh, he's hybrid on placement. Oh, okay, that's actually pretty good. Air type. What? Attack didn't change. Is it gonna change now? No. It's still the same attack. But he got an ability. Disorder type. Okay, now it changed. 
Look at that punching barrage thing. That's cool. That's cool. Hmm. He's probably not bad for uh, raids. Like the sniper raid or something that they just added. Because he's going to be doing like almost a million damage. And he's hybrid. That's nice. Okay, but what about his abilities though? Compass Needle and Annihilation Type. Let me look up what these do. So, Compass Needle. Upon activation, Pattern 9 series gains 720,000 damage for 42 seconds. This ability has a cooldown of 160 seconds. Okay. And then Annihilation Type. Upon activation, Pattern 9 series will deal times 5.5 his damage to all units in range. This ability has a cooldown of 80 seconds and does not have a global cooldown. Oh, so... Huh, I mean, that's not bad at all, actually. It's like a mini nuke that you can spam with all of them every 80 seconds. Okay. Actually, pretty good unit, it seems. Hmm... Hmm, wait, it says he's ground. But when I placed him down in the training area, it said he's air, right off placement. Um, uh, huh, weird. Maybe that's bugged. Oh. Yeah, I just noticed that, um, I can pretty easily evolve this, um, Ichigo to the 6 star version. I just need the rankers. And that's pretty easy. But I do want to see exactly what he does first. I want to see um, see what this 5-star version does. So, I'm going to go do that. Like, it's not going to be anything too exciting or anything. Because, I mean, yeah, it's just a, it's just a 5-star unit. But I still want to see the animations and everything. Because uh, the unit looks pretty good. Looks pretty cool, so I want to see his animations. Okay. Does it look large? No, he's normal size. I don't know. Uh, he does actually look a little big. The model looks really nice, actually. I can't even lie. What about the animations, though? That's cool. I wasn't expecting him to be fiery damage, actually. I didn't look at his um, enchantment, so... I didn't think he was going to be fire. I thought he was also going to be dark, like a lot of units in the game. But, yeah, that's pretty cool. Oh. Finding updated server. Man, I was just trying to look at Ichigo, bruh. Okay, back in here. Back in here. I want to see the next animation. Soul Slash. What? Ooh. Okay, that's cool. It's like they add all these like really cool effects to a uh, five-star unit, but then no one really ever gets to see them because, well, they're obviously just gonna go for the Evos. Soul Slash 2. Ooh. Yeah, this is these animations are really nice. Dang. Special mask on. Alright, now he has, like, the full mask. Did that, like, increase his damage or what? Let me go look what that does. So the 5-star Ichigo's Mask On ability. At Ikipoden's last upgrade, he gains the ability Mask On. This boosts his damage by 100.3 thousand for 2 minutes. The ability has a recharge time of 8 minutes from activation. Okay. So yeah, just boost his damage for uh, a little bit. 
That's cool. I don't really like the animations, though. Very cool. Very cool looking. Okay, but now I'm gonna go for that six-star version of him. Since he's fairly easy to get. Okay, I think I have enough Arankers now. I think. Uh, let's see. Oh. Never mind, I forgot I needed a ranker force. Wait, how do you. How do you. Uh, ah. Well, I'm at all these then. Oh, ah. yeah, I need twos as well, I forgot. <laughs> oh, I'm stupid! Now I should have enough. I'm. I'm eating baguette. I like baguettes. Kind of tasty. You know, the garlic baguette. But yeah, now I definitely have enough. Oh. What the? Okay. Yeah. Then you need those masks and a ranker force. Okay. But hey, now I'm going to go check out... um. What this one does. Okay, now let's see these animations. Bong Bong just messaged me asking me when we're gonna do a uh, sniper raid. And yep, we'll do that soon, I guess. I, I'm just gonna check this guy out first. So he starts full AoE, huh? Okay. That's cool. Then he gets Vasto Slash. Which turns it into a cone. Oh, that's cool. It's kind of like um, one of those attacks that he had um, in his 5-star form. Yeah, that's nice. Looks very cool. Then Vasto Beam turns into a circle. I was expecting um, a line as well, or a beam. Um, this animation seems to be broken though, it doesn't work. Maybe Vasto Beam 2 will? Oh, that's a cone. Um, that doesn't really work either. Unless it's supposed to be like that. animations for the five star version were actually better than the six star one i guess they're just broken oh well okay we're gonna try the sniper raid with bong bong now um why does it say that i have fire rage orb equipped on both freezer and jiren interesting Oh yeah, I'm just using Jiren as the lead because of the money buff and the unworldly beings buff because uh, Freezer's unworldly and Akasa's unworldly. So yeah, we're doing the sniper raid. Alright, I think we just did the sniper or snipe raid uh, 10 times. I think it was 10 times. Let's see. Yeah. Now we just need 5 Ice Soldier 5s. Oh, I only got enough of these to get, um... Mm. I can only evolve either Sinon or Soifon. Hmm... I don't know which one to evolve, though. Let's see... I don't remember Soifon's name. Where is she? There she is. Oh, yeah, Shaolin. Oh, yeah, she needs a Rankers, not Ice Soldiers. Oh, perfect. Then I'll evolve, um... Sinon. Head clap. Yes. Dang. Nice. That's cool. Blessing, huh? Oh. Actually, a pretty nice looking blessing. I like that. 
There we go. I unequipped uh, Jiren so it doesn't have the red glow. So now it's just a blue. Yeah, I like that. That looks really nice, actually. I don't think I have enough Arancars yet, but I guess I'll check. Mm. What was her name again? I I forgot. Again. Uh, where, where is she? Oh yeah, Shaolin. Three Arancar fours. Oh, I can just make those. One, two, three. Okay. I'm just level her to max as well. Oh my gosh. Yes. Dang, baby girl, you look good. Look at those toes. Stop it. Get some help. Uh, yeah, let's go. Let's go ch ch check what she does and also check out uh, Sinon. I used her uh, while farming those Arankers, but yeah, I don't know the animations or anything yet, so I want to see those. Wait, does she have a. Oh, wait. She also has a blessing. Um, uh, okay. That's nothing too crazy, I guess. Hmm. That looks pretty nice, I guess. The you know one, the uh, Soifan one, and the Tatsumaki one. Yeah, that's okay. I want to go back to the bow though. I think that looks really nice. There we go. Now to check out both of these units. The animation should look pretty good since they're both new units. Let's see. Uh, Shinon first. Simple, but looks good though. Modern Warfare 3 Pro Trick Shotter. Okay, let's get that one. It's just the same one, but blue, pretty much. Has a little bit. Uh, yeah, it has some more effects uh, on the impact, but. Nothing too crazy. And Prestige Master. Yeah, I saw this while I was using her, getting the Arankers, but this one has a really big circle. Ooh, yeah, that looks nice. Animation's a little bit glitched, though. Goes up in the air and boom. But then she stays there, because it's glitched a little bit. But it does look cool though. Then... Ability Annihilation and her attack cooldown goes uh, up to 12 seconds. Is this still the same though? Yeah, that is. that's still the same animation. Okay, but Annihilation, what does this do? Upon activation, Shinon will shoot and create a large explosion, damaging all enemies in her range for 2.5 times her current damage. The cooldown for this ability is 240 seconds, and there is no global cooldown. Okay, so it's another like mini nuke that you can spam with all of them. Okay. Seems decent. So if it does 2.5 times her current damage, uh, that 36.7 mil, not bad. So it does 2.5 times that. I mean, 91.75 mil, not bad, but not amazing. It's okay. It's all right. Uh, does it have an animation, though? I want to see. Alright. Now.
Okay, so... The ability was just basically her shooting right below herself. Okay, that's not too crazy, but that's alright. Okay, now I want to check out um, Soifan, whatever her actual name is. Again, I don't know. I don't remember. It's been a while since I read some Bleach. Okay, but yeah, I like the way her model looks. It looks, uh, it looks nice. Okay. Ooh. Oh, wait. Oh, she's full AoE. And Gale Slow on placement? Wait. Full AoE Gale Slow on placement. That's actually pretty good. That's pretty darn good. And very cheap upgrades as well. The attack changes to a two second cooldown? Huh. And it's a cone now. Hmm. Seems. Oh, then it goes to 12 seconds. Okay, this SBA is just jumping around all kinds of places. And then she gets hybrid. So 50k to get her to hybrid. Not too bad. Ooh. That animation looks really nice. Really clean. Oh yeah, but it's 12 seconds though. And then she gets Hornet Wind Whip. Also really nice. Looks really nice. Still 12 second SPA though. Very big range. Uh, decently sized circle. Yeah, I think her value lies in having Gale Slow on placement. And also being like full AoE. Pretty good. Green or I think I'm gonna kill myself soon. I am going to kill myself.